I'm Dr. Shagun Shundairo. I'm the CEO of Arcview Investments Limited. Um, uh, it's, it's a privilege to be here today. I'm so happy, you know, witnessing this laudable event. Uh, so much has been discussed and um, so much has been learned as well. And I see that with this Turkey that you are business summit, it's actually a relationship coming in, okay. opening up the bilateral relationship that has been signed by each uh, each of the countries, you know. And um, with this, more jobs will be created because investors are coming into Nigeria to invest. Yeah. They are coming in to set up companies, industries, okay. and with that, more jobs will be created. With that, the economy will surely grow more. There will be the impact will surely be felt because I've been to Turkey several times and I know what they are capable of doing, and I I, I know what they can they can be bring into this economy. You know, in Nigeria, we have so many more bound uh, companies, industries, you know, and uh, they can come in and support. When they support, they will open up the system and uh, open up the, 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 the country and uh, see how to bring in that expertise, that uh, global way of doing things, the best practices, way of doing things. And when they introduce that into this economy, it will surely spur the economy into you know, bringing it into greater um, uh, space, you know, because uh, they, 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 they are really new. You know, in, in, in Istanbul alone, Istanbul has over about 700,000 companies. Yes. And uh, with that, that is massive. And if that is, <laughs> if so, you know, and we, we, we saw so many of them looking at setting up factories here coming in to invest and um, that that is that is good for me so also for some investors in nigeria as well they'll be going in there to also invest so it's a win-win deal okay. and one thing that you know stood out for me at the summit is that the visa um bottleneck you know getting visa for the, for both countries <laughs> Because they do complain about coming into the country. So this, um, they have promised that something should be done, and something will surely be done. Because they'll be meeting with the both embassies and seeing how to make it seamless. Mm -hmm. And going forward, we can easily move in there. They also can easily come in, and uh, we can have a free flow of um, business relationship. Okay. OK, thank you, sir. Thank you very much. I would like to ask you, what is your advice for the youth out there in order to keep to this kind of opportunity that is coming up? Do you think they, they, will, they will see reason to key into this, or we will just advise them? Yes, to for the youth, they are already waiting for this such opportunity. OK. We have vibrant youth in Nigeria. Yes. We have very strong and agile youth. Yes. When you see them going out of the country, you see them working and them giving out their best. So they are ready to work. Okay. Create an enabling environment for them. They will surely enjoy it. So our government should do more <laughs> by supporting such initiative. Okay. Especially I want to thank um, the organizers, the Global Daniel and his team, for bringing such initiative into the country. So more of this should come up. Our youth are ever ready. If you come up with um, any initiative, they will support you. They are ready to work. They are ready. They have got ideas. They have. They have um, the energy to to go to to do more.